Hi you guys, hope you are having a wonderful Monday. I'm very, very excited about this video. I'm actually getting super emotional just thinking about it, but I can't wait to talk to you guys more in depth about my book because I am a published author. So if you guys haven't been watching my channel, this is my official video telling you guys all about my brand new book called Deep Breaths. I wanted to go into it just a little bit with you guys today and tell you about a little giveaway. I wanted to do this because my book is coming out tomorrow. A lot of you guys have sent me screenshots of Amazon saying that they were going to send it to you. So I just wanted to celebrate <laughs> and talk about the book a little bit with you guys. Here is my book. Here is the copy and I can't even believe that I'm actually holding it because it's been a really, really long process and I kind of wanted to tell you guys how the process happened because so many of you guys have been asking me how that works, how long it took, and I wanted to answer some of those frequently asked questions. So the name of the book is Deep Breaths and it's called The New Mom's Handbook to Your Baby's First Year. I was contacted by the publisher about a year ago at this time and they asked me if I wanted to write a book and I've been asked if there was like a ghost writer or anything. I wrote everything in this book. Everything in this book I wrote myself. Of course there was an editor if I had grammatical errors or something that helped correct it. but. Everything inside of this book, all the thoughts, everything are my stories, everything. This was such a passion project for me because I first started writing it when I was pregnant with the twins and I didn't know that it was twins inside of me at the time. I trucked through and I had deadlines to write chapter after chapter and I had to push it back sometimes because I was so sick. And basically the idea was they wanted to have a new book for moms to be able to give to baby showers or just for millennial moms because a lot of those books are outdated. I wanted this book to be a book that I wish I could have read before I had my first and I honestly believe that this accomplishes that very task and I hope that so many of you, if you have friends who are about to have babies or if you already have kids, I think if you are just a millennial mom in general, this book will be so helpful to you. So basically the process was I had a lot going on. I was doing millennial moms back when I first started writing the book and I was pregnant, I was super sick. So a lot of the times I would write these chapters late into the night after all the kids were in bed, after all my work was done then I would write the chapter. And as cheesy as it sounds, every time I would write, right before, I would say a prayer and just pray that I could write something that could help somebody in the future. People have asked me if I had writer's block. There was one chapter that I kind of had a little bit of writer's block, but every other chapter I felt like it just came to me. And I would just sit down and write 12 pages. Like I just felt very inspired in this book because I am a millennial mom and I have had hard situations as a new mom and I understand that dynamic because I am one of you. <laughs> I hope that by reading this book each woman becomes more confident as a mother, becomes more aware of what things to look out for as far as postpartum and anxiety and just ways to maintain yourself as you become a mom and as you enter this new role in your life. So continue the process. I started in about July, August and then I was done in about January and then I would send it back to the editor then they send it back to me and then I had to have friends read it and get reviews. So it was back and forth, back and forth and it was always with the mind of August is our like publication and I've never done this before so it's all new to me but it was such an incredible process. It was very therapeutic for me because I was going through such a hard time in my life. I had antepartum depression, I had postpartum depression, and I felt like I had gone through a lot, but I'm grateful for that because I feel like it really helped me hone in on those issues that millennial moms deal with when it comes to social life and trying to juggle, trying to have a life while having kids and have a career while having kids it just made me that much more in tune, I feel like, so I'm very, very grateful for that. Another great thing is I was able to have some of my really great friends read some of the chapters so they contributed to some of it. There's I wanted to especially thank Amanda Muse who wrote the foreword in the book. She's one of my dearest friends here from YouTube. So some of the chapters, let me show you. Some of the chapter names, I kind of wanted it to be like a workbook too where you have to write out some ideas and everything like that. So some of it it's how to become the mom you want to be, how to balance a day in the life, how to pamper yourself, some of my favorite recipes, embracing finding, defining the mother within, the good, the bad, and the ugly. Those are some of the chapter names of the book. Motherhood is a wild ride and I am not an expert. I am just a mom. And I wrote that in the book here, like I'm not a doctor, I'm not some like psychologist. I'm a mom just like you, so I understand. I can empathize with you in a lot of 
ways and so I knew some of the things that I've been through as a mom I wanted to share that with you and I share some very personal stories in my book because I want people to understand that motherhood is not easy and it's okay but at the same time you can still be you you can still pursue your dreams you can still be a mother you don't have to be perfect if you guys love the book please share that on Amazon because Amazon reviews are everything, but only if you love it. Of course, I'm not gonna tell you to do it if you don't love it, but if you find the book helpful, if you enjoy it, please give it um, a good rating on Amazon because that would be awesome. I want this book to reach as many mothers as it possibly can. That has been my goal this entire time on YouTube. I don't care about having 5 million subscribers. I don't care about making $5 million. I want to reach as many mothers as I can and give them that confidence and that fire and that spark so that they can find themselves because I feel like a lot of times as moms we lose ourselves. And I put so much of myself into this that it's kind of scary to think that so many of you guys are going to be reading some of the stories and experiences uh, that I put in here. And I hope and I pray that you guys love it and enjoy it and find it inspirational. And I just wanted to thank you guys from the bottom of my heart for making this possible because I wouldn't have been able to do it, obviously, if you guys didn't love me and support me here on YouTube. So there will be a giveaway tomorrow celebrating it on my Instagram. If you guys don't know my Instagram, it is Mish Pearson. So stay tuned tomorrow, Tuesday. That will go live. I'm going to be giving away three books to three of you guys and stay tuned because I will hopefully be doing a book signing soon and all of that. And I'm also having another giveaway coming up to say thank you guys to all of you. So thank you so much once again. I hope you guys are excited for the book. If you guys haven't ordered it yet, I will have the link down below. And can I just give you guys a big hug? I just want to give you a huge hug. Love you, I appreciate all of you and all of your kind words and all of your support for me, my family, means everything to us. I will keep you posted as far as the book signing and all of that, and we will see you guys later. Bye!